Hey, good morning, River Pikers. Hope you're all doing well. Uh, cheers for watching all the recent videos. Um, got back into a YouTube bug and got started making some proper videos again. Um, cheers for watching, cheers for liking, subscribing, commenting, and everything. So much appreciated. Uh, got more to come uh, today. Uh, up at silly o'clock. Uh, I'm currently about um, an hour and a half into four and a half hour trip. Got a bit of a ride out to the coast. Um, not my local coast, but another another bit of coast. Um, I meet some guys. Um, to be honest, I don't know exactly who's turning up. Um, I know there's a couple, a couple of lads who are going, but I'm not sure exactly who will be there. I do know the lads. Um, and these boys do this kind of thing quite often, getting up at a stupid o'clock, um, fishing early, putting the effort in, and, and you know, often reaping the rewards. So, but we're doing something a bit different. I know it's not their, their usual thing. They have done, they've done it before, or similar. I don't think they've been to this place before done similar before so I've got a little bit of an idea I've got no idea uh, I'm not I'm not a sea fisherman uh, so it'll be good to, to have a look at a few things try a few things and see if you know for us to start see if our um, no low fishing kit will work when we're fishing on coast um, I've not got a massive selection of lows uh, I think I think biggest thing with these sea fish well it is technique but I think uh, a big of it is lo a lot of it is location so Hehehehe Hey! Hey! You got this? Little rass Little rass, that's starting it Didn't you go like that? <laughs> That's the one that got away. Smaller. I've got some, I've got some smaller, but I've got sort you out. Yeah, I've got some. I've got a lot of perch stuff, so. Yeah. So. I only one better to start with anyway, so. What size weight, Craig? Craig. Craig. What size weight? <laughs> what size weight? <laughs> <laughs> let's just go down. Move slow, look, small low, let's just go down. Sorry. That's the easiest way down. Oh, that's come back up. Doing that. That's you, boy. <laughs> what, across here? Uh -huh. <laughs> Easy. Turn it back so you see me falling. <laughs> uh. I've got faith in you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I think so. Just watch that green stuff, it'll be slippy. <laughs> I know it does, doesn't it? That's why I've got shorts on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, this is the slippy Yeah, it is, yeah. Is there, yeah? Have you had one out then, yeah? Have you had one out? Uh, oh. Following it in and yeah. it. Right. What are you, are you on bottom or are you like above it or what? I'm just uh, straight in the street, yeah. I'm not letting it sink or anything. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, never. Yeah, go on. Yeah, that's on bottom, that one, it. No, no, were you were you twitching? No, I mean you were twitching. Yeah, yeah, you were. Yeah. Well, good bend that, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. All right. See if we can get in this gully. Craig has a few fish faller from here. Well, he's lost one in that little thing there. So if I can get in here. Fish. Stand on there and fish there, yeah? That's good. Feel it looks good to me. Might have to change because. Well, Craig. Oh, Craig said he was just straight retrieving. And had some fellows of smaller fish. Lee were dragging along the bottom with a, with a weedless rig on like a Texas rig. I'll give it a go with you, Ged, first and then. See if I can just get through rocks and weeds and stuff. If not, I'll have to put a. I've got your brusca. I'll put one of them on. This looks fishy to me. On this edge here. I see some rocks. A bit of weed. I'm just a long edge at weed. Rob's had a little pull, look, I've seen that. Just missed it on camera, we were just climbing down and near the small pollock. There's fish in this cove, definitely. At least Rod were bent below, they were a good fish, he's got a 10 to 40 gram rod as well, so it wasn't like a, it's not like he got a little perch rod. I've got a three inch paddle turn, three inch paddle tail. 20 grams again to get me out. But a minute, I'm just fishing above, trying to fish just above weeds rather than in it or above rocks. See if I can get a fish chase or something. In fact, don't work. I'll do what Lee's doing and get it on bottom. It's all new to me. I think I've got 30 pound braid. I've got a 3,000 reel. Day one Ninja, 3,000 reel. My rod's a eight foot, it's made by Dragon, it's a Xander rod. And it's, uh, I think it's like seven to 35 gram. Braid I've got on this 30, 30 pound. And uh, I've got a fluorocarbon leader, quite a good length, two and a half to three foot length for fluorocarbon leader, which is 25 pound. Braid on rocks is not really good, so you want the fluorocarbon leader. And the other thing you want is a decent pair of boots. That's walking on this stuff, it's not easy. A couple of lads have got trainers on. Not the, not the easiest thing. I know they're a bit comfy, but they're not the easiest thing for climbing. Boots are a bit better, but it's ankle support. A bit more grip. But just take your time, whatever you're doing. It's the dangerous spots, these. Don't fish on your own. You see, there's four of us. Don't fish on your own. If you do fish on your own, you need to know your waters. And, I'm, and to be honest, I'd probably go with a life jacket. Just in case. Imagine slipping in here. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, is that what it is, yeah. Seven gram. Yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, again, yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's some effort, isn't it, mate? Nice one, buddy. Yep. Yeah. Oh, what the hell's that? What is that? <laughs> I'm not touching it. <laughs> no, I wouldn't touch it, mate. Right? With a picture. Oh, no. What am I going to do with that? <laughs> what the fuck is that? What am I going to do with it? Somebody tell me. Uh, unfortunately, oh, <laughs> that looks like a granny fish, I think. <laughs> no, I... It's a beast. <laughs> what do we do with it? Flick it off. <laughs> yeah, mate. Better rock. <laughs> nice. Right, so we had a few microphone problems. But hopefully, we're back working again. So, I'm just I'm gonna see if I can find a new spot. We aren't falling in this rock pool. I've had a few fish. Uh, I've had a spiny, big mouthed thing me what's it. And I've also had a a wrasse about two pounds, so that's my first wrasse, so I'm happy with that. It's best fish at day so far, I think. Oh on loads anyway. Lee's dad's been catching loads on ragworm. Ooh, that was a bit dicey. Um yeah, he's been catching loads on ragworm on bait, so that's the, the method to catch fish. We've been catching on lows, but we found TRDs just slowly drag along the bottom. Catfish there, it's too high up. Yeah, TRDs dragged along the bottom's been working. You want it on a, on a, a weedless rig, so... Chibruska. I've actually got a big one on at a minute. I've cut it, I just lost a fish, got me under it rocks, hooked close in but it got underneath rocks so Let's see if we can get something out of here then. So, I was fishing with a shad first and I stuck it out and I caught that big mouth spiky thing but then when we got, when, we, when Lee figured out what the rats were having, which were the TRDs. He caught a few so I switched and then um, I had a normal TRD the, the smaller ones and I had that nice fish. I, I think I missed it on film so here's a picture if I missed it. But uh, I'm putting a big stupid one on with you. It's like an half a mega TRD. But I've cut like a like a freely end to it. We've got an 18 gram Chibrusca head on it, right on bottom. And all it takes either, they're been solid thumps. I know Lee, you could see a couple of times Lee caught a fish and he got a little knock first, he left it and then he, then he got a, a proper hit. Whereas I, mine have all been solid takes, so I just hit it straight away. Missed a couple, lost one in near side and caught one. I caught a nice one so I'm happy. It's like Xander fishing, like Lisa Daly, it's like Xander fishing. Slow, along bottom. Lee's in again. I'm getting small ones, some really, lots of small ones. Is that a pollock? It's a 
to start with, I thought you might be able to do this with your, you know, with your perch outfit, whatever, but you need a bit of a tougher rod, you know, we're, we're quite brutal here, and it's just 10 to, uh, 7 to 35 gram rod, and I think it helps a lot. I think I've had my little perch rod, 15 gram, and I don't think it'd, it'd cut it. I'm gonna get one here now, get ready. I can feel it. I can feel it! Oh, it's off! No! <laughs> you bugger! Oh, you bugger! Try not to kill yourself. I know you'd like that. <laughs> Probably get a lot of hits, but <laughs> <laughs> summer piker. Summer piker. <laughs> oh, Come on, the stick. I've got to cross this. It creaks a lot more when you're on it. Doesn't it? Huh? It creaks a lot more when you're on it. <laughs> That's because I'm fat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't, just don't look down there. Craig, <laughs> Craig. <laughs> Craig's nope. Nope. Not having any of that. Mate, that's ten times as treacherous. <laughs> Beauty. After that, on a jig. Colourful fish. Spiky. There we go. Beauty. Let's get it back. It's not bad.
Come on, bud. Yeah. Just got, just got smacked. Yeah. Only quite a big shad, to be honest. What? Just on a shad. Yeah. Might be small rats, it were, it were like a little tap. Ah, oh, again. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but I think it might be a bit too big. Yeah. Yeah. Really quick taps, but hard, but little, you know, probably small rats. At least there's fish, mate. First one we're out there, second one we're close in. Oh shit, I missed one then. Oh. Yeah, on that. Yeah. Got me out. I was too late there. You got some small of those, mate. Huh? Have you got your TIDs and stuff? Yep. Yes. yes. Like a nice one there. Oh. A little baby. <laughs> That's what they are, them small ones. Yeah, mate, yeah, they definitely. Yep. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Good take that, wasn't it? We both hit it as well, so we did well. <laughs> oh dear. It feels like a Yeah. You yeah. 